Good morning, I'm Stephanie from GrinningLikeAnIdiot.com doing a guest post on Kevin and Amanda's to show you guys a little bit about Log Me In. Log Me In is a tool that allows you to remotely log in from your uh, from any computer, whether it be PC, Mac, iPhone, iPad, Android device, whatever. You can log into a local computer as long as you know the username and password to get into that computer. So right now I'm actually in Log Me In on my laptop. And what I'm going to do is get to my desktop and start editing some pictures on my desktop from my laptop. Okay, so here I've already got two computers set up. This is my iMac, so I'm going to access that. It's going to ask me for my username and password. And so once I'm logged in, I'm going to, now I'm going to be able to see my desktop. So from here, I'm going to click on Options, and I am using Safari. I found that Safari uh, makes the full screen mode better than Firefox. So I've got, here's my a picture that I have in Photoshop. You can see it up here. So from here, I'm going to actually manipulate it a little bit. So I found this useful over the last week. Um, I was actually downstairs the majority of the time this past week because uh, I had a little bit of surgery. And from that, I could just lay in bed and work on my ebook that I'm working on here. And so I've got, and you're using the same keystrokes that you would on your desktop to make everything work. Pretty cool. Okay, so now I can even control save that. Now another neat feature, when you actually you know, use Log Me In for the first time and you're allowed 30 days for the pro version. The pro version has a fee to it. But however, there's the free version, which is basically doing what I needed to do right now, which is just access and manipulate files. The pro version also allows you to transfer files. Now this I'm finding very useful right now, because what I want to do is essentially make this computer, my laptop, now a thin client and make my desktop, the powerhouse where I actually manipulate files and use the files. Because that one, this one has 12 gigs of RAM. This one is five years old. So I'm going to start using this one just to access my main computer. So with this, I'm going to show you guys how to transfer files too. So when I get back to logman.com, there's an option over here called File Manager. So when I click on my file manager, it's going to pull up two windows. On my left side, it's got the files that are on my Mac. And on my right side, it's got the files that I have on my desktop Mac. So here, all I have to do is select a file. So this one's my 14 hands wine recipe. I'm going to transfer that over to my desktop. I'm going to click move and it's going to ask me, do you want to move it from your MacBook local to my iMac? Say yes. Takes a couple seconds. And it's done. I hope you guys enjoyed this brief tutorial on logmein.com and I hope you find it as useful as I have.